Hey everybody, Viking Wizard back at you with another unboxing video for you. So I've got another one and this one's Motorhead. We play rock and roll live at the Montreux Jazz Festival 2007. I actually know that the album Kiss of Death was released in 2006. So is this from the Kiss of Death tour? I'm not sure. So um, if anybody knows, let me know. But this came up and just says... Live at the Montreux Jazz Festival 07 Rare and previously unreleased material from Cloud Knob's private collection remastered in superlative audio exclusive linear notes. So this one's going to be very interesting. So let's get into this. So yeah, if you if you know it's from that tour, then let me know because I'm not sure. But I did have a little look at the track listing and I play quite a few things off the Kiss of Death. The songs off that album so i'm guessing it's from that album and in the album after the kiss of death i checked and nothing on is on this set list so i'm guessing it's from that tour so there's the artwork there's the back with the track listing i love when bands release stuff like this so like they release it from selected tours which i think is absolutely awesome there's a band from that year which is cool then we have the discs, show you the discs first and then I'll show you the book and stuff. This too. I actually thought that might have been this one, but that's this too. Then we have, oh, this is going to be a pain to get out without wrecking it. <coughs> this one. As you in there, we are Motorhead and we play rock and roll. <coughs> Absolutely fantastic band. It was a shame about Lemmy passing away, but um, old age gets us all eventually. There's a book. <coughs> this is going to be interesting. There you go, a bit about the festival. I know Corn and quite a few of our acts have actually gone to that Jeff Festival and played. Which is cool. Track listing for the CD one, which is cool. And there's Lemmy and Phil Taylor. No, not Phil Taylor. Yep. I'm losing my plot here. There's the, a live picture, which I'm guessing that's from that show. They have the second disc, which is the um, track listing and some more live shots. Then there is credits, as you can see, which is awesome. And it actually tells you where this was recorded, um, producers, where it's produced and all of that sort of good stuff, which is cool. And the back just tells you the... Montrose Jazz Festival medal. Not medal at all. I've, I've said to quite a few people, Motorhead are a rock and roll band, not a heavy metal band, but I know they get roped in. But as Lemmy said in one interview, he said the only reason they get roped in with the metalheads more than um, the punks is um, whatnot, because he associates more with the punks and stuff. But the only reason they got lumped into the metal was purely because of his long hair, which I thought was interesting but that's in one of his documentaries he actually says it so i thought that was cool some useful useless knowledge so i hope you all enjoyed this i'll put a link in the description if somebody comes across this because everybody knows motorhead but you get the odd person that are like um i've never seen this live one and i wouldn't mind adding it i didn't get to my collection or something like that so go check it out um i actually not listened to that yet so i can't wait to listen to it i know it's been on spotify but i thought i'm gonna wait because i want to play that version I really can't wait in the track listing from it is very cool. My favourite track is actually on here, which is um Kill by Death. But one of my other tracks, Born to Raise Hell, as they've never played they've rarely played live for quite a while, so I think it was early nineties was the last time they played it or something like that. So hope you all enjoyed this video. If you're new to this channel, if you wanna like and subscribe, hit that notification bell and all that sort of good stuff because it's mainly unboxing videos just about to unbox a Led Zeppelin. Um, a show of Belates Hall, gig reviews, tattoos, um, all that sort of show of what's in my collection and 
just genuinely me showing off the music and the bands that I love. So I hope you all enjoyed this. So Viking Wizard, I'm um, signing off and I'll catch you in the next video. So have a good one and see you later.